It was Brum's day for exploring the big town. He was brumming his way along the pavement, but the traffic was so noisy that he turned into the park for some peace and quiet. make a noise. <coughs> the baby's brother and sister weren't very happy, so its mum tried to soothe it. But the brother and sister still weren't happy. They began to fight over their skipping rope. No need to fight, said Ron. Free can play. to roll away. Oh, the baby! shouted Brum. You had everybody really worried, said Brum. Got to get you back to your mum.
Nearly there. Honey, thought Rum. They don't seem all that worried. They could have lost their baby. And then what do you think he noticed? The baby hadn't been in the runaway pram at all. The pram had run away by itself. They all thought it was very funny. But they were glad Brum saved the pram. Even though the baby was with them all the time. Thank you, Brum, said the children. What a fuss, thought Brum. Babies. And off he went, brumming, happily, all the way home. It was Brum's day for exploring the big town. He was brum, brum, brumming his way along the pavements when, just by a zebra crossing, what do you think he saw? Another kind of zebra. It was a photographer and her assistant on their way to take pictures of animals. Suddenly, it stopped in its tracks. They've had a puncher, thought Brum. The lady was cross. I thought I told you to check the tires, she said. Now, what do you propose to do? Who's going to carry my tent and equipment? Oh, no. well, this little girl could carry something, said her assistant. Please to help, said Brum. Place. This way. Stop. Stop. 
will set up camp here. Bring the equipment. Camels. It's no good they keep moving. Make them stand still. Give them something to eat. going. Lions tomorrow, little car. <coughs> Not for me, thought Brom. Time for home. 
Goodbye. Bye bye. And off he went safely, brumming happily all the way home.